Hi, this is Harish Bali from Technofair.com. There are many photo editing apps for smartphones. Few days back, I did a review on PhotoGrid and Snapseed, and today I'm going to talk about an app which is less known but does a good job on picture in picture. Friends, I am talking about PIP camera. You can go to Play Store and download it from there. For ease, I have connected my Android device with this system. App name is PIP camera. I have already got this installed, so I am opening it. Open. This is the home page of the app. Let me first share few cool things that can be done under classic mode. I can choose an image or can take a selfie to begin with. So I am taking a selfie. Okay. After selecting the image, it has automatically added an image to the template. That makes my selfie look even more attractive. I can adjust the image inside the template by moving it up down like this or try out different templates. If I need to see more templates, simply tap on this download and there are a host of templates to choose from. Move the image. I love this app for its functions on picture in picture. I can easily change the foreground image or the background image from here. I would prefer to change the background image. This is the image that I would like to put in the background. Here it is. Tap on next. Tap on save after making changes in foreground, background or both. Save. And once you save the editing, you can easily share it on any of the social media platforms mentioned here. Back to home screen. Let's explore magazine. Under magazines, there are three types of frames that are available. One with one frame. Scroll down and then you will see options with two frames and then three frames. Under the first option, you can choose one frame at a time and edit it in the form of a magazine cover. For more magazine cover layouts, there are options that are available. Similarly, under second frame, you can choose up to two images and under third frame, you can choose up to three images. Let me pick up a second frame image. So I am picking up images from my camera. Any two random images. Next. So these are the two random images. One can easily reach out more magazine cover options by clicking on this download option. Back to the home screen. Under the collage option, I can create an image collage by selecting up to 10 images. I will pick up some random images from my camera. Next, choose between different styles, effects, outline or radius. Similarly, you can also change the background, whatever suits. Once done, simply save it. Let's go back to the home screen. Let's explore Pro Edit. I can edit any single snap using these filters, stickers, text, edit, mosaic and adjust options. I'll tap on filters. These are the various filters options that are available. Go back. And there are a host of stickers that are available. You can just pick this is your theme of the picture. Go back, easily write text on the image, tap to put input and you can easily rotate it the way you want to put it. Change the font, color. So I am writing, hello friends. Move it around on the screen and save it. Let's go back. This adjust also has got some of the good filters like contrast, saturation, sharpen. So you can decrease it or increase it the way you want to really work on these filter parameters. Go back, stretch. So you can stretch any particular portion. Supposingly, if I wanted to stretch this particular portion, I can simply increase the stretch. Can you see the difference? Bring it to the normal level. Back to the home screen. This is an ad running on the home screen. So be sure before you click on it. Instamag and PIP lock screen. These are the apps which you can install and try out if you really want to try.
try out other photo editing apps. I hope you found this PIP camera app useful. I am sure you are going to love it too using the picture in picture editing mode. If you found this video useful, do give it a thumbs up. Also watch other interesting videos by clicking on the links appearing in front of your screen. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and thanks for watching.